everyone, I'm Mackenzie, and I would like to welcome you back to our final episode of Weird Animal Facts Parrot Edition. We've talked about a lot of the things that make up a parrot in our past episodes, such as feet, tongues, and feathers. But now, it's time to talk about parrots as a whole and the relationship that we as people share with them. Parrots have actually been around for a very long time. You see, birds began as dinosaurs, and when dinosaurs went through their mass extinction, some of those bird ancestors survived. The oldest parrot fossil remains, dating 55 million years old, were found in Scandinavia, of all places. These remains, called Mopsida, are the oldest and most northerly parrot remains to be found. The oldest southern hemisphere parrot remains are only dating about 15 million years, which suggests that parrots actually originated in the northern hemisphere and diversified to the southern hemisphere later on. Now, this is when we become a part of parrot history. Cave paintings that include macaws have been discovered in Brazil, and these paintings are thought to date about 5,000 years old. The first written reference to parrots is in the Rig Veda, which is a sacred Indian literature that dates about 3,000 years old. They are also mentioned in Geoffrey Chaucer's The Canterbury Tales from 1476. In the 13th century, Marco Polo reported seeing parrots in southern India, and there are some stories that say that Christopher Columbus may have been led off course by a flock of parrots while sailing in 1492. There's no surprise that these beautiful birds have inspired many books, movies, and characters, even in present time. There are some people who even have them in their home as pets. Now, our biggest hope is that if you're considering bringing any animal into your home as a pet, you do your research. As beautiful as these parrots are, they have a lifespan of well over 50 years. They are also naturally noisy, destructive, and messy. As much as us here at Zoo Atlanta love our parrot friends, we understand the amount of money, work, and time that goes into each individual and strive to make that known to every guest who enters our gates. I, along with all of my parrot friends here at the World of Wild Theater, want to thank each and every one of you for joining us throughout this series. I hope you learned a lot about parrots and what makes them so cool. Until next time, goodbye! Bye. <laughs> There you go. <laughs>